Lucina and Kyle Thompson met at OSU as freshmen and married a year after graduating. What happened in between was the development of a deep friendship before that friendship turned romantic. For both, it was life-changing, as was their time at OSU, where the couple developed a worldview guided by their faith and placed serving others ahead of themselves. Lucina and Kyle's approach to life has led them to work together to help others, both around the world and in their own community. Their success in business, generosity to OSU students, and faith-centered mentoring has affected countless lives. The way I got to know Kyle and Lucina, uh, I had started my own company. We were growing rapidly, needed to hire more consultants, and so had a recruiter that was helping us with that. He's going through a set of resumes, and he said, now, I've got this one resume. She does not have the experience you require. She's an OSU grad, and since you're an OSU grad, that may be uh, something. So anyhow, I wound up meeting Lucina, and of course, she dazzled us, and so uh, we hired her, and I met uh, Kyle along the way. And so first time she was gonna go solo uh, was in Montreal. So she flew into Montreal late one night, had the training materials and so forth for a session with senior management. Well, of course, in Montreal, she got caught up in customs. She was locked up in the Montreal airport all night and didn't get out till around midday the next day. The session was supposed to start in the morning. Lucina, in her inimitable way, of course, charmed the socks off of everybody, dazzled them in the session, and over time, Lucina really became our senior person with the Royal Bank of Canada. They are the family that when you go to dinner with them, they, they are going to beat you to the waiter to pay for the meal. It's they give in small and in great ways, not just in a meal, but if you go sit in a living room, Kyle and Lucina, they're gonna sit in the most uncomfortable chairs. It's a running joke. I, I, I have a running joke with Kyle. I'm like, Kyle, you sit in this chair. And he's like, no, 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 this is good for my posture. And it's just because he's always thinking about, hey, how can I serve other people? Hey, how can I care for other people? In small ways, like giving up a chair or maybe paying for a meal, but in other ways of like literally inviting people into their home. From getting to live with them, from watching the way that they love others, I got to see what it looked like to not only um, learn about God's word, but follow what his word says. But I do believe the thing that distinguishes them the most is what I think they would call what I would call servant leadership, and that is leadership that is powerful not only because of what it can accomplish, but what it returns to other stakeholders, be those employees, be those customers, be those uh, colleagues. I've known Colin and Lucina for over 35 years, but I really uh, got to know them when we coached, Colin and I coached football together uh, with our boys starting in the fourth grade. Kyle was, a, was just a great coach. Um, they say that, that your work can be your ministry, and uh, he was just, to me, just an example of that. In the early 2000s, we served on a board together of an oil and gas company, and it was early in the shale revolution, and we were drilling wells in the city of Fort Worth, and the company hired uh, maybe 200 young people right out of school, and Kyle took it on himself to mentor all these young people. And there are so many parents that I run into, even today, that go, I just can't believe this. They don't even know him, but would say, I just can't believe this Kyle Thompson and what a influence that he had on my son or daughter. They are the definition of loyal and true. They have loved people at Oklahoma State in a way that I've never seen before. They are still so connected there. They um, have invested their lives, not only here in Dallas, but also in Stillwater, Oklahoma, to many students through scholarship, to um, Pi Beta Phi, or um, through the foundation as well. They are the biggest fans. You can't go anywhere in their house without seeing some decal, shirt, something about OSU. Now, let me be really clear, okay? Um, I didn't go to OSU, but look at me, I'm wearing this shirt. You know why I'm wearing this shirt? Because everybody wants to be on Kyle and Lucina's team. I would say OSU is special to them. That's where they met. That's where they are educated. That's where they have a love for learning. They're both very smart. Their love for each other began there and their love for that school. They are, they are great ambassadors for OSU. So anybody that knows them knows they're wearing the orange. They reflect the spirit of Oklahoma State, which is helping others and having a culture 
that is not elitist, but is very collaborative and helping. Kyle and Lucina, um, first of all, thank you for being there for me. I'm so uh, happy that you're, you're receiving this recognition uh, from Oklahoma State University. I think it's so well deserved and, and uh, it's such a wonderful thing. It's a, uh, to recognize a life well lived. Congratulations, nobody deserves it more. I think what drives them is a hope that in whatever they have done and what they've modeled, that it would inform, that it would instruct, and it would inspire others of us to up our game uh, in our leadership and particularly in how we share with others in ways that de develop other leaders. So uh, I'm pretty sure that Kyle and Lucina, I would say to you that, uh, that you have issued us by how you live your life a challenge for all of us, challenge accepted, and thank you very much for providing it. I want you to know that I am beyond thankful for you and both of you and the way that you um, loved me in really hard years, um, the way that you still continue to love me in really hard years and great years, the way that we laughed. Thank you for being my friend, a mentor, a wise counsel, somebody that I can just sit and laugh with, and thank you for the way that uh, you've ministered to my heart. We love you, friends, and we feel indebted to you. Words, words just fall short. I want to hug you to say thank you for your example, for the way in which you have um, modeled integrity and love and generosity. You are um, the people who I want to be as a parent. You are the people I want to be as a husband and emulate as a couple. And, um, and I'm proud to call you my friend. I've learned so much from each of you, and I'm blessed by your friendship. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming the newest members of the Spears Business Hall of Fame, Kyle and Lucina Thompson.